In this video, I'm going to show you how to set it up so that when one object touches another object, it makes one of them disappear. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach, attach this action to my player object. And what I'm going to say is the event is when it has a collision with the enemy object. And then over here from the second tab, I'm choosing this little recycle bin here, which is called destroy instance. Now, if I left it as self, it would destroy itself when they touched. Other, it will destroy the other object that it touches. And object there, it's actually naming an object that it destroys. So it could destroy, say, all of the enemy objects. I'm just going to set it to other. So, just to repeat, when they have a collision, destroy the instance other. Let's see what this looks like when it plays. Okay, so there we go. I have my um, ghosts appearing, but when I go up and I intersect with them, I zap the ghosts. And they can't respawn because I haven't coded them too. So once they're gone, they're gone. So on collision, delete that object.